welcome back to the vlog it is Wednesday and I am in my car because I just got home from doing many things on my break so after I was done work on my lunch break I actually have to go out to the doctor to get my TB test done because I need it for this placement for my course and that starts later on but anyways I needed my TB test done along with a lot of other things that I actually have to get done that are piling on but that is for another day and then after that I grabbed myself some freshie and I did not grab the soup that I always get the name escapes me but it's like lemon spicy lemon soup something spicy lemon pepper soup maybe that's what I get I forget I forget the name even though I used to get it so much um, I got a different thing today I got the pangoa bowl and I'll show you guys when I'm inside work starts again at 1 and it's currently 12 21 so I have about half an hour to eat and I have to go back to work so let's go inside all right so here's the pangoa bowl honestly they could have topped it up more but whatever uh, cherry tomatoes I believe coriander corn beans rice and then barbecue sauce on top i think it's brown rice as well as some cheese in there so yeah it looks really good and i'm gonna eat it now Happy um, Wednesday, Thursday. Happy Thursday. Uh, it's not happy though because I have to go get my blood test done and I am freaking out because I just, I've never gotten a blood test done and I hate having like things poke inside me and just, oh my God. Anyways, I am completely freaking out because I don't know what it's gonna feel like. I am not excited, not one bit. I don't want to get this done, but I have to get this done because I need it for my placement um, in the summer in order for me to complete my like um, program. Yeah, I'm just not happy about it. And uh, so I'm gonna go in and um, I guess wait for it and then, I, I don't know. I was not very happy with the fact that I have to get this done, so yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go in and I guess I'll talk to you guys after my blood test is done. Okay, bye. Okay, 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 I'm done, okay. Um, hold up, let me take my mask off. Um, wasn't too bad. I actually feel like I hyped it more in my head than it, like was I don't know it actually did not hurt it felt weird having knowing that something was going inside me and like taking blood out but it wasn't like the the pain that I imagined um it was like the tiniest prick honestly I felt like my COVID vaccine hurt more than that like or the flu shot I didn't feel this one as much and she said that my arm is not going to be sore or anything so yeah we got that done which is great i'm so happy it's over with it was really fast i was in and out which was great um and i had an appointment booked in so it was just fantastic i'm just so happy it's done i do not want to do that again even though it wasn't bad i just don't don't want to have to do that again because i hate knowing that i have i have this thing where i just don't like metal i don't like i i just i don't know what it is i don't like i just don't like metal um it freaks me out even at the dentist the fact that when they have to use like metal um tools on my teeth it freaks me out like it's just a weird thing i have i just don't like metal and so knowing that something metal <laughs> was going inside me it just freaked me out so yeah um i'm good i'm done I think I'm going to, I don't know what I'm going to do now. I have um, about an hour before I have to go back to work. Um, again, I'm on my break doing all of this stuff, which was actually yesterday too. I had to get my TB test done on my break. Um, but yeah, I, I think I might get freshy again. I don't know. Maybe this is just an entire um, me getting things pricked in me and me getting freshy type of vlog. Uh, I don't know. I'm not that hungry right now, but we'll see. Anyways, I'm going to uh, check back in later. Okay, I'm gonna go get Mary Brown's because I feel like I just deserve Mary Brown's after what I went through. Right there, I'm gonna go get it. Okay, hello, hello, happy um, Friday. It is so nice today. It is 29 degrees currently um, and I am loving it. From the Kiss oh, 92.5 studio. There we go. Okay. Um, sorry, my podcast started playing. Um, 
So I am currently going to work because I have to give a Google Educator exam. Um, it's just this educator exam that we have to give, uh, especially now that we're distance learning, we just have to give it in order to be Google Educator certified. And so I'm gonna be going to do that. My exam is at one. I have never given the exam before, but I did prep a lot. And um, from what I've heard, it's a pretty okay exam. They have like multiple choice questions, but then they also have um, application-based scenario questions. So I studied for it, but we'll see how it goes. You don't get results right away. You get it a couple of days after. And I need at least an 80% to pass, I believe. Like you need an 80% or higher to pass. It's not like a 50% kind of thing. It's closed booked, it, it's proctored, and I am kind of just anxious about it. But I think I will be okay. It is also super hot um, and I want to turn the AC on, but I don't know if that will wreck the audio. I hope not. Anyways, um, AC is on. It's okay. Um, yeah, I am also not going to get anything to eat because I feel like if I get something to eat, I'm going to have to go to the bathroom right away. TMI, but I might have to. Um, so I'm not going to get a coffee. I'm not going to get Timbits or anything. I'm just going to, I already ate. So yeah, I'm heading out to uh, work. I have babbled a lot right now, but I'm heading out to work. Then I'm going to come back home and I don't know what the rest of the day is going to look like, but um, yeah, I'm going to go to work right now. car intro happy um sunday sunday happy sunday uh it's sunday today i'm pretty sure yes it is and i am on my way to see my friends who i haven't seen in a really really long time because patios and indoor dining and everything is still closed we're planning on going to cheesecake factory and just getting something to eat maybe honestly just getting cheesecakes and then sitting outside and just hanging out with one another and i'm really excited because i haven't seen them in such a long time i mean obviously because it's been locked down but i'm very excited to see them other than that i don't think there's much of a plan today i'm gonna be home it's currently 10 30 so i'm gonna be home later i think around three and then i actually have to get work done um i have to film a little bit and then i'm going to be going to um work out so that's the plan um but i'm gonna go see them and then we'll see what's up after that Happy Monday. I don't usually vlog on Mondays because Mondays are the day that I upload the vlog and I usually end it on Sundays, but I didn't feel like ending it yesterday because I just have, hadn't had the chance to sit down and talk to you guys about the other things that I wanted to show you. So I decided that I'm gonna vlog today and just include it in the same vlog. So it'll be like, you know, today's Monday and I'm uploading today, hopefully. But yeah, um, a bit of good news. On Friday, I wrote my Google exam and I got the email yesterday that I passed it. I was so relieved because honestly leaving that exam i wasn't i i knew i did pass but every time after an exam i just always am unsure of myself in terms of like what questions i got right and what questions i got wrong um and i was pretty unsure about the practical aspect of it but i'm um, sorry not the practical but the multiple choice aspect of it practical aspect was so easy like it wasn't hard at all but the multiple choice i always just struggle with multiple choice so then naturally i knew i was going to struggle with that but i passed and i'm so happy i am done with that i am certified for now three years every three years you have to renew the certification so i will do that after three years but um for now i am certified um i also made a purchase that is quite big but it was necessary for me so let me show you guys what it is so i decided to get myself the new macbook air and let me actually show you guys because i am obsessed with it okay and here it is i love it so so much this isn't a part of it i'll actually show you guys the entire thing but um yeah i'm just i'm just very much in love with it it was a much needed purchase for me and i want to show you guys more about it so let me open it up Okay, so here it is. Um, this is actually just a hub that I have because on both sides of this MacBook Air, there's actually no ports. So I needed this hub because I needed all of my like USB-C ports as well as my SD card port. Um, but yeah, the coolest thing about this is that it actually has Touch ID. So I can just put my finger here and there we go. All right, so here it is. I'm just absolutely in love with it. It is so fast compared to the one that I had. 
The MacBook that I had that I was using for god knows how long was from 2011 and I had not upgraded since I had that MacBook. It was just the MacBook Air from 2011 and after getting this one, I can tell the 10 year difference that is there within both products. Like the processor in this one is super, super fast. There's a new chip. Like it just, the speed of this laptop is absolutely insane. I just started editing this vlog on the laptop and the difference I see in the time it takes me to edit is insane like that's actually one of the reasons why i jumped onto getting it because my other laptop there were so many things that were going wrong with it um it was like it was just an annoyance at that point and i was like you know what i'm gonna keep doing this so i might as well invest in another laptop and so i got this one and i'm so happy with it um there's honestly not much else to say about it it's just a normal macbook air again i'm no no tech um channel so i can't really give you guys the details but um there's many many videos uh, oh, look at Mina. I feel like she's going in. Oh, Muji's inside there. Um, sorry, tangent. Uh, yeah, but I know that there are many videos on um, YouTube telling you the specifics of this laptop. That's actually how I um, decided I wanted the MacBook Air. I was going to go with the Pro, but the touch bar on the Pro wasn't something that I was interested in. I just didn't see any use for it. I feel like it's just another, like, um... Um, gadget or widget that they've put in but I don't really see a use for it so I went with the air because I was familiar with the air from beforehand and yeah I'm just really really happy with it I also have this IKEA order that came in a week ago I think I just haven't had the time to open it so I thought I might as well open it with you guys these are actually the jars that I ordered um, to fill my spices in with and um, I'm hoping they sent me the right, right amount. It's just been sitting in my living room and I haven't had the chance to open it, so let's see. Oh, perfect. Wow, the wrapping's really nice. It comes in like its own um, thing. They actually did it really well. Okay, let me open this. I'm actually impressed. Wow. And here they are. Okay, hold up. Let me like put this aside. Here they are, they're the Crokin um, small jars that I use for spices and I'm glad that I ordered five because I recently purchased some more spices um, that I needed to put in it. So um, I thought I initially purchased four but I'm glad to see that I purchased five because I actually did forget. I just really like these. I think they're so adorable and so small and they work perfectly for my spices. Um, I know people usually buy the long cylinder ones and I think that's great too. I just had this one to begin with so I didn't want to change my entire spice cabinet out. So I'm just going to stick with these tiny ones. I just I just really like the shape of them. They're so, so small and so cute. Um, I don't think I'm going to be doing the spices today. I really, really wanted to, but I am so behind on so many things. I truly just took this long weekend as a week to, not a week, sorry. I took this long weekend as a weekend to just relax and I did absolutely nothing from Friday to Sunday. Like I didn't do anything those three days and I'm, I'm like paying for it now because I have to do work stuff. I have to upload lessons for my students and just create lesson plans for the week coming up. Um, and I have to uh, film TikToks, which uh, I have not done yet, but I have to film TikToks. And um, and then we have to go out, grocery shop, not grocery shop, get like some things from Loblaws, I think. And I wanted to work out today. Don't think I'm gonna get time for that because I have so many other things on my plate and I have to edit this vlog and put it up. So. My plate is kind of full and I don't think I will have time to actually do all of this um, spice stuff but I'm hoping in the upcoming week I will get to do so because I just want to make my cabinets really really pretty and really organized and I have a lot of spices now that can go into spice jars so yeah I think that will be coming up in the next week but um, I'm glad I got to show you guys my MacBook I'm really really happy I'm gonna go hopefully make myself a pesto sandwich right now because I'm super hungry and um, then get to work because I have to work now.
currently 7.50 p.m. I wanted to hop on here so I could end the vlog because I want to get it uploaded for today. Um, I was just downstairs getting ready to cook. Um, nothing special. We didn't end up going grocery shopping, so I'm just cooking with whatever we had in the house. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I don't think it's this upcoming week, but the next following week on June 1st or 2nd, I'm getting my wisdom teeth removed and um, I'm pretty nervous for it. They're not going to put me completely under. They're going to give me oral sedation, so I will still be like not under I will I won't know what's going on but at least I won't be put asleep um, but yeah that's like completely like I think two weeks away right now June 2nd today's 24th so yeah I have a bit of time anyways I have my wisdom teeth removal coming up on June 2nd um, other than that this week I don't really think I'm doing anything. I don't really have anything planned. I think I might actually hang out with friends again um, this week, but I'm not completely sure. We haven't finalized on anything, so that's up in the air for now, but I did want to come on here and just end the clip off for today. I hope you guys liked it. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!